Hello again, I'm Luke Refm as always, and today I'm bringing you another mystery shirt episode. Um, I have some shirts from uh, Mystery Jersey King. Um, I've already, I haven't looked, but I've already ripped that ready to go. Uh, Mystery Jersey King, and then we've got Mystery Shirt.com, Mystery Football Shirts.com. I apologize. A lot of these companies literally have the same name or very similar name, Mystery Shirts or Mystery Football Shirts. They're not very original. At least, at least Mystery Jersey King is a little bit different, so it's a bit easier. So, and then um, later on in this video, I'll have a, um, I'll be opening a shirt from, uh, it's a retro shirt, and I can't remember what the company's called. I'm waiting for it to get delivered. So, um, but yeah, it'll it'll come part of the video. But anyway, so let's start with the first one. This is, like I said, Mystery Jersey King. Um, like so. So, like I said, I haven't looked, but I have ripped it open because the time really saves on time. Um, a nice bag there, Mystery Jersey King. Um, it's got one of these sealed as well, so that's good. Just open it up like so. And uh, it's a purple one. I've not seen this one before. Is it Anderlecht? No, it's not Anderlecht. I thought it was Anderlecht, uh, Belgian team. So it's VFL Osnabrück, Osnabrück, German team. But it's quite snazzy. Purple with a gold trim. Um, on the back, it's got the, the name, the team's name on the back as well, which isn't too bad at all. So, um, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like I said, um, not like a top team, like Bay Mini, like this one, but it's still quite good. I, I'd happily wear this um, doing a video or going out. But yeah, let's um, let's see what I look like with it on. Two seconds. So here it is on me. It's a little bit, let's move this up here. You don't want to see my belly. Um, it's a little bit tight, a little bit snug on me, um, but that's not necessarily their fault. Puma shirts are usually a lot tighter than Agas and I, so it is expected. But like I said, I probably wouldn't wear it out because it's, it's making me self-conscious, but um, doing a video where you can only see the top part, all right, it feels nice as well. It's, the material feels nice. Um, so yeah, but the badge looks pretty cool. Sorry, going the wrong way. There you go. But yeah, not bad at all. Um, yeah, so, and then the next, I'll show you the next shirt in a second. Right, before I open up the next box, um, I got given this card in the Mystery Jersey King one, and it just gives you the team name and the country. But also on the other side, I've got this as well. Now, I'm not affiliate with any company. Um, I'm not getting paid to do this, but I could use this for myself, but I thought you lot might want to use it as well, if possible. So try this code if you order a shirt from Mr. Jersey King, MJK22. Um, give them a try. Sit, let me know in the comment section how you got on. Um, I'd like to know what shirts you got. Maybe you got better, maybe you got worse. I don't know. It all depends on what, you, what you're what you looking for. If you're looking for the top brand shirts or the top team shirts, you're probably not going to get them. If you're like me and you're just looking to just get random shirts that look pretty cool and you can just use them for doing videos and stuff or going to the gym, playing football or whatever, then, you know, let me know in the comment section how you get on with it. So um, the next box is from mysteryfootballshirt.com. Before I open it, um, inside the box, because I've already opened the box, I got given a, a stack, I think it's a sticker or something. There you go. And um, this card as well. There's no, there's a little there's a classic Ronaldo on there, um, and then there's that as well. But there's no there's no discount code or anything on that. So yeah, but um, yeah, that was everything in the box. And then here is the shirt. I've already figured out. Who, well, I say that. Oh, I thought I figured out who, who it is. Um, right, I'm done. Let me see if you can figure that out. I thought that was Denmark, but I don't think it is. So let's open it up and find out. I wouldn't mind if it was Denmark shirt. I quite like the Denmark shirt. I don't think it is the Denmark shirt, but I could be wrong. Somebody will let me know in the comments section. Um, but it's not it's not a bad shirt. But yeah, Hummel. Um, is it a Denmark team? Is it a Danish team? Oh no, it says for Denmark, so it must be. Yeah, I think that's Denmark's. Yeah, this is Denmark's shirt. Um, Hummel. Let's see what year. 
Um, it doesn't say. Does it? Will it say on the bottom here? Official of uh, authentic apparel, apparently. So that's always good to know. For more, um, it doesn't say here. No, I think it's the Denmark shirt. I'm pretty sure. I, I, without pausing this. Um, but actually, I will pause it, and then when I come back, I'll have the shirt up, and we'll have an answer. But I think you lot already probably know, but I need to know from myself. So yeah, I'll be back in a second. I'll have the shirt on, and then we can find out. Yeah, it is a Denmark shirt. I double check. I don't know which year it's from, but um, it's probably a recent one. If it's Hummel, I don't know. But it's pretty cool. I'm not bothered. I quite like the, the white trim. Uh, I like the shade of red. Nice badge, Hummel. It's 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 a bit tight. As you can see, on it's a bit tight. I mean, this is again 3XL, I think, but that's more to do with my body type. Um, bit bit chubby me, 22 stone, so it's uh, it's understandable that it's going to be tight on me. But it's not. As, I don't think it's as tight as the other one. So that's good, and it feels nice on me as well. It feels tight on my arms, which is good because when I work out, there you go, gun show. Um, but yeah, pretty good. Quite like it to be honest. Um, yeah, pretty cool. I'm I'm quite happy with this one. Again, I, I'm my favourite colour is red, so I can't complain. But yeah, pretty good. So on that note, I'm gonna leave you lot to it for now, and then in the next part of the video, um, we'll have the next football shirt, um, for the retro one. I'm really looking forward to seeing what retro shirt I get. So yeah, I'll be back in a, in a soon with the next part of it. And we're back for the final part of the episode. Um, this box right here turned up today. Um, I have I haven't looked yet, but I have Rick's open ready just just to make it easier for everybody because I might have been there all day trying to get the box open. It doesn't make for a good video, but yeah, just nothing. Uh, you know, it's just a white box, no logo or anything like that. Mystery Retro Shirts Limited. Um, for anybody who wants to, so I I took a chance. And I ordered a 2XL. Now I'm usually a three or mostly a 4XL. So I've got a feeling because it's a retro. I thought because it being a retro shirt, a 2XL might be equivalent as like a modern 3XL, 4XL. Um, but I, I don't know. We'll see. If not, I'll just have to return it and wait until I've lost a bit more weight. I'm gonna have to, I'm, I'm aiming to try and lose. Um, a few more stones so hopefully i'll be a 2xl one day but yeah so anyway um like i said here's the box so let's get it open here um right let me just rip it open not the shirt rip it open i'm in the bag ah there we go um and then ah, here we are it's a yellow shirt so if i show you that first oh i stand up there you go. Um, I think from the logo, I think it's a Mexican team. Now, I have noticed in the box there is a card, so I'll have a look in a second. But yeah, um, let's go a little bit close up of the logo, close up of the, the badge. I'm not very good with camera angles. I think that says Tigris, doesn't it? Um, let's have a look what the card says. So that's the card, that's the front of it. And then on here, yeah, Tigers, 1992. Oh, that's good. Not bad at all. 2XL, 1992. Um, right, in a second, I'll uh, put it on and then you can see. Yeah, so sadly, this is way too tight on me. I am never wearing this out. Um, I'm self-conscious as it is. But yeah, this is too tight on me. It fits, but like, just. It's very tight on me. So, but it's a nice shirt. I won't get rid of it. I won't return it because it's not their fault. At the end of the day, I took the chance. Um, it feels nice. It's a nice top. Like I said, um, what I'll do is I'll keep it. I might sell it. Hold on, let me sit down here. You can't see me. Um, I might sell it or I might keep it and then it will give me more motivation to lose the weight. So, the more weight I lose, the the it won't be so tight on me. Hopefully, um, so yeah, so it's not a bad thing, and it's quite a nice shirt to be honest. And if I'm if I'm, if I I can actually I could wear it if I'm doing the videos because you can't see my belly, 
and it looks quite nice on my shoulders and it's quite tight so yeah it's uh it's nice it's nice shirt it feels nice nice color um so yeah i'm quite happy with that so mystery retro shirts so here you go i don't i'm not sponsored by the way this is just me just giving them some uh press okay some uh what they call promotion for free there you go um yeah so i'll probably order another one i'll probably message them out and ask them if they can specifically try and find one more fitting for me they might not have any because i think the old retro shirts only went up to a 2xl um so it's it's one of them in it but like i said it's a nice shirt nice end to the video um i will be doing a few more of these i'll do i'll be doing some fake football shirt videos as well so in a few weeks i think in three weeks time i'm meant to be getting this order from uh dh gate so and i've ordered some others from this guy i got recommended on facebook so i'll get them at some probably the end of next week so maybe the week after i'll do a video with them um i've ordered 10 10 modern football shirts off him um so yeah so i'll keep you posted with that how it goes and um, thank you hope you enjoy the video and i'll try and produce a few more leave a comment let me know let me know which um, mystery ship companies you've used in the past so if because i'm i'm going to try and um i'm going to try and buy a shirt from every single one of them so i can say look this is what i got from this one so then people know when they want to buy a mystery football shirt what they're going to get and i'll try and do the same companies over and over again after a while and just see so people can get like a varied idea of what they're going to get but yeah anyway right i'll leave you to it enjoy the rest of your weekend and i'll uh, i'll be back next week with a full schedule of football manager content and tw 2020 content and maybe hopefully you never know a mystery shirt uh, video again so yeah all the best